Okay, so there seemed to be a little bit of confusion about how to uh, how to rename the main CPP file. Uh, so I wanted to create a quick video to uh, to show that. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and create a new project. Um, our our current assignment is uh, is Benford. Um, so I'm just going to create the uh, the project name Benford. And um, then we uh, then we get our window here. Let me just uh, resize this so that it uh, fits in. Uh, space here. All right, good. So now that I have this, uh, first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to go to uh, my project window here and you'll see, uh, you'll see here's my, uh, my project name Benford and uh, there are the two main files, right? So we see, you know, for instance, uh, right here that, uh, that this is the CMake file that tells it, uh, tells CLion um, what, which uh, is our main file known as main.cpp. Okay, so to change this, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on uh, main CPP here and I will right click and then I'm gonna go down to, let's see, hopefully there is a refactor um, why is there not a refactor now? Let's see. Um, <clears throat> maybe under file. Oh, it's still updating symbols. Sorry. Okay. Now that everything's all updated and all that, hopefully, let's see, I should be able to come here. And yeah, there it is, right? So now notice when I right click, um, I come down here. Here is refactor and I can go to rename. And basically then I can change this to Benford, right? So when I do that, um, instead of main, it's going to uh, make the change there. It will also make the change in our, uh, in our uh, CMake list file. Notice it does say CMake project needs to be reloaded, right? So I can do reload changes. I can also turn on auto reload, which is even better. So that way, anytime changes are made here, um, it auto reloads it. So let me go ahead and do that. Um, you'll notice it's going to uh, kind of go through just to make sure that uh, that everything's up to date. And finally, now I should be good to go. So when I build uh, Benford and run this, you'll notice uh, there it goes and it, uh, it has run my program um, and there is my Benford C++ source file. Okay, so easy peasy.